to visibility by 7, there are a series of tasks. First is to double the last digit, then subtract it from the number made by the other digits. The result must be divisible by 7. We can apply this rule to that answer again. Let's have a little side note of the multiples of 7. And then our first example is 9215. What is the last digit? The last digit is 5. Now the rule says that we should double 5, it gives us 10, and then subtract it from the number made by the other digits. The number made is 921. 921 less 10 is equal to 911. Then repeat the same procedure. We double the last digit, which is 1, multiplied by 2 is equal to 2, then the remaining digits are 91. 91 less 2 is equal to 89. Next is we double again the last digit, that is 9, it gives us 18, then subtract it from 8. 8 plus 18 is equal to well, if you're in middle school or high school, you already know how to subtract integers, the rules of signed numbers, which means that you can answer this. It is negative 10. But don't worry if you are still in grade 4 and you don't know the rules of signed numbers. You just simply subtract 18 less 8. The answer is 10. Still, 10 is not divisible by 7, which means that 9,215 is not divisible by 7. The example 1093. We double the last digit, that is 3, it gives us 6. We subtract 6 from 109, the answer is 103. Again, we double 3, it gives us 6. We subtract 6 from 10, the answer is 4. Still, 4 is not divisible by 7, which means 1093 is not divisible by 7. Our last example is 5796. We check the last digit, that is 6, and then we double it, which gives us 12. So drop 12 from 579. The answer is 567. Next, the last digit is 7. We double 7, it gives 14. Subtract 14 from 56. The answer is 42. Now we know that 42 is divisible by 7, which means that 5,796 is divisible by 7.